All right, guys, I'm about to record, so I need some quiet, all right? All right, thank you. I realize I live in fear a lot more than I'd like to admit. Fear of loss, fear of time, fear of God. Always in some state of worry, anxiety, or panic. I imagine this part of my life must be sad to watch as I worried away. Throwing away this gift, and it is a gift, this life. The spectacular journey of being alive. I think we tend to forget it ends. Because when we're aware of something's impending resolve, we savor every second of it. Like a good meal, or an even better film. We enjoy it till it's finished. The difference with life is that we always think we have just enough time. Enough time to wait. To build up the courage to say I love you. Enough time to let go of pride. Enough to do it tomorrow. I think I'm better off living in anticipation of today's impending resolve now. To see just how much of life I can appreciate in a day. And if tomorrow finds me here, I'll do it all again. I like to think of my life as a film. A movie God will play back showing me how every part of it was necessary. A story worth reading till the end. And like all my favorite films, there are scenes that are painful to watch but necessary to see the larger story through. So I keep going. If there's one thing I've come to learn about myself, is that I'll always be alright in the end. The thing I love about protagonists is they always come out on top. So I don't demand all the answers now. But I know they'll be worth it. This is all worth it. And at the end of my life, if anyone asks if there's anything I'd do differently, outside of walking with a little less worry about the things that won't matter then, and a little more appreciation for the things that will, I do it all again. This time around, as you got so crazy that my feet can tumble. Haven't you ever seen a summer wind? It's my.